Hello, everybody, and thank you for joining us here again at Hemp Town's YouTube channel. We're, of course, sitting here with Mike. We have some updates we want to go through with you guys, introduce you to some products and so on. But first off, Mike, how are you doing? Uh, doing pretty good today. Thank you, Michael. Good, good. The hat's looking very nice. Yeah, that's a new that's a new hat. We've got our, our symbol on there. Uh, we've secured the symbol H-E-M-P uh, on the TSX Venture Exchange. So uh, that's pretty exciting. I like that. Awesome. That is a great, that's a great ticker to, to nab there. And uh, like I said, the hat's looking great, but here kind of moving on a little bit. So kick us off by telling us what's the update with the trailer park boys thing. Uh, the update is that uh, we're going into our, uh, our branding sessions with them starting next week. Um, we've hired a group in Vancouver, a uh, real well-known uh, street artist by the name of, uh, he calls himself Chairman Ting. His name is Carson Ting. Um, ChairmanTing.com would be a great, you know, to look up. He's, his, his, he does stuff with Nike. He does stuff with Adidas. He's just doing a candle for Drake. Um, he, uh, he, just did, uh, he just did some uh, NFTs for the tr uh, Toronto uh, Maple Leafs. Uh, he's just a really well-known street artist, and um, and so he's going to be help us design the pack. So these are kind of the existing packs we have. This is our pineapple pineapple express. Um, you know, we have a, a, a spearmint or a menthol, and then we have what we call the, the premium, uh, which is a blend of CBD and CBG, um, and they're three different price points. And then yeah, so we'll be co-branding a pack with the Trailer Park Boys. Uh, uh, the initial name that we've come up with is Bubble Butts. Uh, because of course bubbles is the, the main character yeah for sure so we haven't run that by them yet but that's our that's where we're starting and uh and chairman ting is going to design a pack and um we're gonna you know we're gonna run a couple of stories potential stories where how we can blend the the uh the smokes into their um into their dialogue and, and get them you know using them mm -hmm. so we're gonna run a, a three scenarios by them to to try and get that done here yeah, there's a there's what a carton looks like yeah hmm. yeah so the packs, uh, these ones sell for about 10 bucks, 11, 13. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Tell me more about, um, when you guys were talking the Delta eight hemp smokables, tell me some more information about that. Yeah. So we, we produced, uh, we just picked up, uh, we just got an initial run of 2000 packs. Uh, mm -hmm. they're a 10 pack, um, comes in a little you know drawer. I wish I had some with me, but we really can't bring them into Canada. Unfortunately, I'm in Canada um this summer be heading back to the states uh, on saturday but they're, they're in a little drawer pack 10 pack um we have uh, flavors bubblicious which is a cherry flavor and uh, and then we have um then we have the um the, the pineapple as well and uh they're they're pretty cool they're uh, i i asked them to drop down they were pretty strong when i first sampled them from the manufacturer they put 50 milligrams of uh, d8 in them and you couldn't really finish one, um, you know, depending on your tolerance. But so I asked them, I said, let's let's drop these down to uh, to 20 milligrams and uh, let's go after that light market. You know, and obviously, you know, Bud Light, um, Players Light, Diet Coke. Those are all the, the biggest uh, the biggest brands within those respective stables. So I think a, a light a light smoke is going to go over pretty well. So uh, that's the market that we're going after. And some other guys that, you know, they go after the, uh, they, they were making some for someone else that were 80 milligrams, but you know, those are, you're going to fall out of your chair. So um, uh, we just, we just got the first shipment like yesterday and uh, they're just, they're, the, we're taking them to the distributors and, and going around to the smoke shops now. And uh, I'm sure they're going to fly off the shelves. Uh, pricing on those, they cost us about, about $3 a pack to make. Um, we, uh, we wholesale them for around $9 and, uh, we paid a commission and then we were the, it's a $20 suggested retail price. Gotcha. Um, yeah. So I think, I think they're going to sell well. Yeah. I mean, Delta eight has been kind of a craze here in the U S space big time. And, um, I really like your guys' strategy there and going for a little bit lighter of a dose. Cause as you had previously mentioned before, you don't want to have to smoke half of something and put it back away. You no. want to enjoy the, the, the full stick, so to speak. Yeah, and I also wanted to mention that these um, that these things have a uh, flavor capsule in the um, in the uh, filter, uh, you know, similar to uh, a Camel Crush. Mm -hmm. uh, I uh, I haven't smoked a Camel Crush, but uh, so you you take the, the the filter and you and you pop it. It, you, you, it made a noise. You probably couldn't hear it, but and that releases the pineapple uh, flavoring. So that's pretty interesting too. No, I don't think anyone else is doing that. Um, and of course, we grew, we grew this hemp 
and um, we've uh, the process all the way from seed to sale, we call it wow. um, quality control. So good. I mean, it sounds like your guys' sticks are performing well and you got some interesting things coming forward here. So let's mm-hmm. shift gears a little bit and tell me what else is going on. What are you getting into over the next couple of months? You had mentioned some expos and such. Yeah, um, well, I, I want to mention that, of course, we I think we did talk about that uh, financing. Uh, I think we put out a news release. I uh, I didn't see it, but that we had closed the first million and that we were going um, we were going to increase it to a five million. And and we had a pretty good week. We raised about six hundred thousand this week alone. So we're pretty happy about that dollar uh, forty a share. And um, yes, we are going to the uh, White Label Expo CBD Expo in uh, Las Vegas on the first and second of September. Uh, we have a pretty big booth there, and uh, and then we'll also be at the um, uh, the the convenience store uh, National Association of Convenience Stores um, convention. It's um, October sixth uh, and seventh and eighth in Chicago, so that'll be a big one for us. We're looking forward to that, and um, yeah, I mean everything's just really been coming together for us uh, lately. So I'm I'm pretty happy. Yeah, sounds great. I mean, Las Vegas, Chicago, you're going to have a lot of fun out there, Mike. Listen, Mike, thank you so much for coming on. And uh, thank you, everybody, for watching. You have any questions about any different brands, any specific flavors or anything, or just what else is going on with him, Tom, let us know, and we'll happily dive into that, too. But for now, stay tuned. We'll get you some more news over the wire as soon as we can. Mike, thank you so much for coming on. Great. Thank you, Michael. Take care. Ciao for now.